The federal government has given Minnesota a little more time to comply with the Real ID law, but not as much as Governor Mark Dayton and other state officials had requested. The U.S. Department of Homeland Security has given Minnesota a grace period until January 22nd. It allows Minnesotans to continue to use their driver's licenses to get through airport security into federal buildings and onto military bases instead of the upgraded Real ID license that has stricter security checks. The state planned to make the new IDs available beginning next October, but federal officials did not grant that extension. Minnesota has lagged behind other states in complying with the Real ID law that sets minimum standards for all state-issued driver's licenses and IDs. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.